What a guan, dreadies and dreadette. Welcome to TDI TV. I am your host, the Dirty Immigrant. And this commentary is about a favorite topic of every news program. ISIS or Muslim extremists in general. Now, I have a question. I hear a rumor that if someone strap a bomb to themselves and uh, they blow something up, that their reward will be 72 virgins in heaven. Now, I don't know how true that is, but I have some statements and questions about said 72 virgins. First off, don't you think it would be a good public relations move that instead of 72 virgins, it's 69 virgins? Think of the implications. I mean, 69 virgins. You would have people joining like crazy with just a double entendre that would be in 69 virgins but anyway you went with 72 I don't know what the meaning of that number is for you I don't know I can't think of anything why you would have 72 virgins but anyway so my question is why would any man in his right mind would want as a prize 72 virgins no you strap a bomb to yourself you blow yourself to bits you get to heaven and you are reassembled but now you have to go teach 72 virgins how to pleasure you the blood clot is up with that you know what I mean listen if I blow myself up and I get to heaven and I'm going to get my, my 72 women, just get me some prostitutes. I don't have no time to teach nothing. I'm supposed to go up there and go, ah, let me enjoy and lay back. I don't want to teach nobody anything. And that's 72 virgins. That's 72 women I got to teach. No, no thank you. I'm not teaching anybody anything. My reward should be relaxing and enjoying, not teaching. If I wanted to teach, I'd stay alive and teach other people stuff. It's not very logical now, is it? Get me 72 hours. I'll be cool with that. I'll relax for the rest of eternity and get taken care of. Now, I have another question. Isn't there women who blow themselves up too? Do they get 72 virgins when they get to the palace in the sky? Or are they still gonna be subject to the same oppression, if you will, while living here? Which is really messed up, you know what I mean? You, you, you gotta cover your face, you gotta be demure, you gotta be uh, submissive and, and be obedient and then go blow yourself up. That's kind of messed up. You know, so, <laughs> that don't make no sense at all. But anyway, do they, the women, get 72 male virgins? And they may just as well have the same complaint that I have. Why would they want virgins? They want to have fun when they get there because that's the, 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 the intention or that's the premise of what would happen. You've got 72 virgins, that means you're going to have lots of fun. A martyr that gets his just deserves. But since you all are so overprotective of your women, I doubt that you would give them 72 virgins, right? But if you do, since I'm a born-again virgin, I volunteer on the one condition, I'm first. <laughs>
I'm first. Because I don't want to be the last of 72 horny virgins. Now, you know, this is kind of off the subject, but I have a question. I was thinking about this. What? I sound like I'm going to go too far? Who cares, man? I could go as far as I want to. Now shut your bumbo cloud mouth and produce. You're not my co-host. Stop interrupting. I'm sorry. Where was I? Lost my chain of thought. Oh, 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 the question. Now, by large, in countries that are Christian countries, when people reach the height of passion, they would say, oh God, oh God, oh God. Now my question is, someone who doesn't say God, like for instance, a Muslim who says Allah, do they go, oh Allah, oh Allah, oh Allah. Man, that sounds like too much work. You know, where God is one syllable, Allah is two. That's a lot of work. You know what I mean? You want to save your energy for the action that's taking place. <laughs> you want to save your energy for that. But anyway, those are just two things that makes this whole 72 virgin things seem impractical. I wonder if it's true. Because everything we hear about it comes from mainstream media here. I have never heard an, a Muslim say anything about 72 virgins. And it's kind of sad to think that more virgin men are in rushing to the forefront to get them 72 virgins since they can't get none on earth. <laughs> anyway, just something to think about. Comment in the bottom. Tell me what you think. Like favor, and subscribe. This is your host, The Dirty Immigrant, and this is TDI TV. Remember, always walk in peace.